Hello, can you believe the sitcom The Beverly Hillbillies was released 61 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Nancy Cobb was born on August 28, 1921, in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, USA. She played Jane Hathaway in the sitcom when she was 41 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1991, she passed away at the age of 69, leaving us deeply saddened. It's simple, so you could wear it to the bank. <laughs> and she will, she will. <laughs> I, 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 I just, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Getting to work with Brian Keith. And getting to work with Brian. We worked together years ago on The Parent Trap, the Disney picture. And of course, Brian lives in Hawaii, and so we will live in Hawaii. Irene Ryan was born on October 17, 1902, in El Paso, Texas, USA. She played the character Daisy Moses in the sitcom when she was 60 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1973, she passed away at the age of 70, leaving us deeply saddened. Jed, that boy is turning into a first-class girl chaser. Well, I always said, if you're gonna do something, do it well. Make a joke of it. Pretty? <laughs> Buddy Epson was born on April 2nd, 1908, in Belleville, Illinois, USA. He played the character Jed Clampett in the sitcom when he was 54 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 2003, he passed away at the age of 95, leaving us deeply saddened. Nothing yet. The Brewster fellow said he'd bring the money later. How much they gonna pay you? Well, uh, he said I'd depend some on how much oil they could pump out. And we came to Hollywood in 1935, and we were featured in uh, Broadway Melody. I stayed on, my sister went. Linda Hannings was born on September 16, 1944, in Los Angeles, California, USA. She played the character Jethryn Bodine in the sitcom when she was 18 years old in 1962. She is currently living happily at the age of 78. Howard Hughes is both sweet on me. I don't know which one to favor. Mr. Hughes is married. I think I'm going to favor Sam. <laughs> Junction. Watch me. Watch me. Watch me. Watch me. Watch me. Watch me. Donna Douglas was born on September 26, 1932, in Pride, Louisiana, USA. She played the character Ally Mae Clampett in the sitcom when she was 30 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 2015, she passed away at the age of 82, leaving us deeply saddened. Chop in this dish with the cover on it. <laughs> Tell me what you like. Well, uh... But they don't think that the moratorium that would be good. I mean, it seems like most people say no because it's just pulling all the work away from there. Everything, the the. Harriet Emma Gibbon was born on October 5th, 1905, in Chicago, Illinois, USA. She played the character Mrs. Margaret Tristell in the sitcom when she was 57 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1987, she passed away at the age of 81, leaving us deeply saddened. Zillionaires. <laughs> she has her own private fleet of yachts and a staff of ex-husbands to man them. <laughs> Everyone in town is trying to find her and get her dressed up. If you're a private detective, where's your gun? <laughs> oh, that's simply marvelous. Max Bear Jr. was born on December 4, 1937, in Oakland, California, USA. He played the character Jeff Thor Bodine in the sitcom when he was 25 years old in 1962. He is currently living happily at the age of 85. <laughs> Boy, driving that thing without a steering wheel sure keeps the fella hustling. I'm pretty near run over that little old gal. <laughs> so it's because of all of the. The, the new technology. When I was a kid and when we were doing the Hillbillies, there was only really ABC, NBC. 
Shirley Mitchell was born on November 4, 1919, in Toledo, Ohio, USA. She played the character Opal Clampett in the sitcom when she was 43 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 2013, she passed away at the age of 94, leaving us deeply saddened. Big man. Not you, Jake. That jerk. That jerk. Oh. <laughs> Maybe the good news is right here in this mailbox. I do, I do uh, uh, conventions. I'm going to Seattle in June to do a Jack Benny show. Wow, that's um, so he still has a legions of fans. Chuck Fisher was born on September 26, 1907 in Tabler, Oklahoma, USA. He played the character Shorty Callums in the sitcom when he was 62 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 1984, he passed away at the age of 76, leaving us deeply saddened. I mean, this isn't the Silver Dollar City funny farm, is it? Oh no, here's Uncle Jed, he's got more millions than you can shake a stick at. Raymond Bailey was born on May 6, 1904 in San Francisco, California, USA. He played the character Milburn Dristow in the sitcom when he was 58 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1980, he passed away at the age of 75, leaving us deeply saddened. I never met the gentleman. Miss Hathaway, what's the idea of letting this southern fried pony in my office? I never an appointment. You said he had a million dollars. Jack Bannon was born on June 14, 1940 in Los Angeles, California, USA. He played the character Bob in the sitcom when he was 24 years old in 1964. We regret to inform you that in 2017, he passed away at the age of 77, leaving us deeply saddened. Uh, you can't build an open fire in Beverly Hills. Ah, oh, sure you can. All you need is seasoned wood. <laughs> well, what I mean it. B. Bernadette was born on April 4, 1906 in New York City, USA. She played the character Carson Pearl Bodine in the sitcom when she was 56 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1968, she passed away at the age of 62, leaving us deeply saddened. She says death row's been offered a job by the government. <laughs> no, she didn't say what kind of job, but... Just a minute, Jeff. Frank Cady was born on September 8, 1915 in Susanville, California, USA. He played the character Sam Drucker in the sitcom when he was 53 years old in 1968. We regret to inform you that in 2012, he passed away at the age of 96, leaving us deeply saddened. Out of the three of you in front of the shack. Now for the front page, uh, Jed, you and Howard be shaking hands. Let me know who's your favorite characters from the sitcom The Beverly Hillbillies and share your thoughts on the deceased actors by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.